think I kind of realized that despite having all, you know, all the resources in the world, you can still face all sorts of challenges in trying to do the best you can for for kids with special needs, which is something that I hope to help with when um, when I'm ultimately done with residency, and it's impacted my, you know, career choice quite a bit there. I think with any rare disease, uh, it's just so important to have a community. Um, and you know, there's all sorts of aspects of the community that I'm sure are important, but I think the biggest thing for us is, you know, just like the simple things that we see. Like we, we, we've done this walk, the, uh, the Hope for Hannah is our team, uh, but we've done the, the walk uh, for mitochondrial disease. And the purpose, you know, of the walk is to raise money for the, uh, for UMDF. But, you know, the real, joy and excitement that we get from it is walking around Freedom Park in Charlotte with other, you know, a million other people who either support our family or support other families with kids with Mito um, and other, you know, other kids who have Mito. And you get to see the huge spectrum of children who are going through this and also the, the love and support that they get from their families as they're going through this too. So I think it just gives you, um, it gives you a community of other people and then it also gives you you know, I've, I've talked to my to my mom and my dad about this too. It gives you just a a network of uh, of support.